Now this video I took on the 2nd of January I think it was and it was down at the Kilcool Breaches and here you can see the Brent geese flying around. Now there's a lot of Brent geese always around the east coast of Ireland at this time of year but you can see them, they actually have murmurations. They fly up, they fly around, they don't seem to fly in any particular order. People thought they were just migrating around looking for better patches to feed on but they actually just sort of just seem to do it for fun. And here you can see them, they're getting closer and closer. Bear in mind this was uh, handheld in very poor light even though it was a sunny day but it was the light is very poor that uh, early in the year because the sun is very low in the sky and of course I'm facing towards the west uh, from the beach direction there's Dunran Hill and here you can see a few of them flying in more detail and they, they fly of course in mostly V formations and here's some perch down well down at the water in, in the water and they seem to be cleaning themselves and this is in the marsh on the uh, inland so I'm looking away from the sea inland to where the estuary is and these are widgeon widgeon are beautiful duck that come in large numbers to the breaches and the breaches this is the channel where the estuary breaches the the earth the bank the, uh, the beach it goes into the sea but you can see the tide has changed and now the water is actually flowing up towards the bridge that's the railway bridge there there's a footbridge attached to it and it's almost like miniature tsunami uh, it's more it's a true tidal wave only it's very small but you can see the way it, when the tide changes it starts to come in and it flows right up the river it starts running up the river uh, and to be honest that, that's not really a proper river now here you can see the wetlands, the grasslands but you can see where it's very damp at this time of year and there's more than brent geese in there you can see some grey lag geese and of course we get white fronted geese from, uh, from Greenland as well and the Brent are in, the ones in the foreground now I think they're, they're either grey lag or they're white fronted geese. It's hard to tell, but well an, an expert would tell no problem. But those uh, even from that angle, those further inland are those ones, the Brent geese, which are small geese. There you can see Brent geese and Widgeon going along. There's a few waders in there. You'll actually notice curlew. Well it's actually uh, it's I think there's a few uh, few different kind of birds in there, yeah, there's, and you might even see a couple of other waders. And it's lovely, the geese graze, geese are grazing animals, like they actually graze the grass. And they have little, they swallow stones and they have these very polished stones inside them in their crops to help uh, break up the grass. And here's a little argument happening, look at that. <laughs> it does happen between geese. It's lovely to see them. Now it was a very, very windy day that day. I was struggling against the breeze. And those are whimbrel and, and I think there's a few actual curlews in there, but they're, those are whim, whimbrel, which are related to the curlew. There you can see the breeze and we're looking inland and there's the train, the train runs between the sea and the swamp, the estuary. There's Sugarloaf and Little Sugarloaf 